All right, everybody, here's a quick introduction to trees. In this video, we're only going to cover some of the terminology. A tree is a nonlinear data structure where nodes are organized in a hierarchy. This could be one example of a tree. It's made up of nodes and edges. Nodes could be some piece of data, and edges represent a relationship between two nodes. A real-life example of a tree could be a family tree. Maybe we're at node D. That's us. Or me. Or you. B is a parent. E is your brother or sister. A is a grandparent. C could be an aunt or uncle. And F is your cousin. A few examples of where a tree data structure would be used in programming or technology would be file explorers, databases, domain name servers, and the HTML document object model. The top of the tree is known as the root node. The root node doesn't have any incoming edges, only outgoing edges. Any nodes at the bottom of a tree are known as leaf nodes. They do not have any outgoing edges, but they do have incoming edges. And branch nodes are in the middle. They have incoming and outgoing edges. Here's a few other terms. Any nodes with outgoing edges are also known as parents. Any node with an incoming edge is known as a child node. And nodes can be both parents and children, if they have both incoming and outgoing nodes. Any two children that share the same parent are known as siblings. Nodes D and E both share the same parent of B, so D and E are both siblings. The same thing goes with B and C. Nodes B and C share A as a parent, so these two nodes are siblings. It's just like a family tree. A subtree is a smaller tree held within a larger tree. You could say that this portion is a subtree. The size of a tree is equal to the number of nodes. So what's the size of this tree? We have one node, two, three, four, five, six. The size of this tree is six, six nodes. The depth of a node is the number of edges below the root node. Our root node would have a depth of zero. Then as we move down levels, B and C have a depth of one, D, E, and F have a depth of two. And lastly, the height of a node is the number of edges above the furthest leaf node. All of these leaf nodes are the same distance away from the root node. These would all have a height of 0. B and C have a height of 1, and A has a height of 2. Well, all right then, everybody. That is a quick introduction to some of the terminology around trees. It's a nonlinear data structure where nodes are organized in a hierarchy. And in the next few topics, we'll get a little more in-depth with trees. If you found this video helpful, please help me out by smashing that like button, leave random comments down below, and subscribe if you'd like to become a fellow bro.